Run. Good morning, Mama. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning.
cógele, Pelín. Headed to play basketball. Bas get you, get you, get your head in the game. Got to get you, get you. Get you. Wow. Daylight savings really out here, allowing us to have good it's weather. It's rocking. Jimmy, 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 put the ball down. <laughs> <laughs> the park is filled with people, so we might just opt out of the basketball activity and go play, play some shopping and therapy at Target. At Target. Don Don by Don. Don 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 Don. Wait, so where are we going? Should we go to the park first? Yeah. Yeah. Like, where is it? I forgot how to get there. You know where to go? I feel like maybe I know. No one behind me, right? No. So do I turn left this way? I mean, right this way? No, you go out that way. Yeah. Oh. They're like really good children. <laughs> or are they adults? I can't remember. We have arrived at the next basketball court. There are chances that it's also filled. The weather's so nice though. The bong I ate earlier today is really fucking bad. Yeah. Oh, which bong did you have? You had it. Like, the, had, like, oh, the half one. chocolate, half almond? No, 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 no. the Sobero that had like the cream. Yeah. Ew. I had half of the almond croissant and then half of the chocolate. Oh yeah, I had a, chocolate. a little bit of the almond. Oh, I went ham after for the dinners. I had like so many different snacks oh, that, that I didn't show good. on camera. They're all so be like, <laughs> Oh, but this is a couple of times. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you look like a constipated bunny. I just did a tally. One more time for the fans. Really good stuff. Yeah. Okay, let's go ball with the bros. Okay. This is cool. Wow. And then people just watch you? You looked so cool, dude. I know, I'm so cool. Don't mind me. I just have Troy Bolton in the back. Oh, did you see that? I did, I did. Oh my god. Oh! Did you see that? I did, I did. Get your, get your, get your head in the game. <laughs> Traveling! Traveling! <laughs> what do you think? Oh, look at the sky, it's so lavender. It's really pretty. It's like lilac. Okay, so like, we're gonna ball with the first pro over there. Are we really? Dude, let's just, let's just ask. Let's just Why sit. not? Let's just sit and then see what happens. Should I ask him? No. No? He's good. This is embarrassing if we play with him. Like, it'd be offensive. <laughs> How about we just wait here for like five minutes or so? And no, then we start. No, and then we start dribbling around the court. <laughs> <laughs> In circles, like start a drill. Yeah. Oh my god. That's to me. Like, start warming up a bit. Do the, do the five minute drills. Yeah. <laughs> I'll be like, yo, Shim, chuck it, you know? 
Oh, <laughs> which gym? <laughs> hey, too. Check it. Should I ask them? I be like, hey, is it cool if we slide in? <laughs> Start balling? <laughs> It doesn't hurt. But they're all like boys, so they don't have like no shape. We just learned a K pop dancer right here. <laughs> we learned, we learned Don Don Don. It's probably, it'd probably be better at TikTok than, than basketballing <laughs> at this point. That is a fact. I want to watch like a dance performance. Oh my god. I'm doing everything on the bottom half that you can't see. <laughs> I'm doing it now. And now I'm doing it top. <laughs> okay, maybe the guys that are playing shoot one-on-one. Oh, they're like... Oh, Were those shit leaders? They were just... They do free throws and they're like... Oh. <laughs> Should we go to Target? That was a fail. We literally just waited for like 30 minutes at the court and no one left. So off to Target. More places? I'm really interested in some meat. Yeah. <laughs> If you're growing, I'll get him. No, but okay. What do you think is the length of this? <gasps> Let's go get a ruler. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my friend said that the Quest cookies and cream bar is good. I always wanted the gummies. I really want the gummies. There must be a ruler here. Oh, that's whole skin. Okay, I'm gonna go to the snack section because Sandra wants to be efficient. I'm gonna go out of my pack. <laughs> We're at Target. Headed to the snack section because we need more snacks. We as an I. Oh, <laughs> shit. Hello, everyone. Mini Ruby Magnum bars. Oh this sounds God. so good. We're gone for like an hour. My mom is like, where are you guys? Yeah, I don't have my um what's that thing called? But what was it that I what was it that I wanted again? Oh yeah. Where are them skinny pops at? Yeah, like the little rice cakes. Okay, let me just find rice cakes then. Wait, like let me know why I can't see the ones I've been wanting. These sound good. Yeah. Yes. What she wanted. Oh yeah, yeah. I have enough. Well, let's get that. Let's get vanilla ice cream. Who's paying for this? I mean, I can. Do you want to say hi to the vlog? Thanks. See you again soon. Thank you. I need you to hold. Okay, I'm back in my room and I wanted to do a little haul real quick of uh, some things that I picked up at Target today, which you guys saw me do. But I'm excited to show because I love snacks and I love food. So let's get started. First one I got was the Boom Chicka Pop. This is in the sweet and salty kale. Sweet and salty kettle corn, and I actually really like the skinny pop one. I think it's sweet and salty is the flavor that I was looking for, but they only had white cheddar and the original popcorn available there, so I opted for the kettle corn one instead. This one tastes a bit too sweet for me, but the sweet and salty one from Skinny Pop is like the perfect combination. It's like 25% sweetness when you order boba, and this one's like 50%, so there you go. Next up. I got some rice cakes. I was also looking for the Skinny Pop rice cakes. They like are like small little like squares and mini ones, but they didn't have them, so I cried a little bit. 
but instead I opted for just the caramel rice cake patties. I actually haven't had these in a very long time, so this will be interesting. I got them in the caramel and I really like the sweetness of this. As you can see, I am having a sweet tooth. I don't know if I'm PMSing just yet because I, I ended my period not too long ago. So. And then last but not least, I got the Haribo Star Mix. I've been eyeing these for a really long time every time I go to Target or any any place. I always have so much fascination with the Star Mix because they have a combination of a bunch of different gummies and I always want to try out each one individually so I was like why not just get this. One thing I don't like in this mix is the Coca-Cola one. Funny story, I actually haven't drank, I have not drunk, gin drinking. I have not taken a drink of coca-cola ever since i was like seven i'm like this weird health food kind of gal when it comes to high fructose corn syrup which this probably has glucose syrup is the first one it's not good for you at all i just remember i read the news and it said how coca-cola the soda is the worst one to get for your body and so ever since then i was like yeah no i'm not gonna drink coca-cola so that's there's that and then there's also mcdonald's french fries I have never, I have not eaten McDonald's french fries ever since I was like seven as well. Yeah, it's a weird, it's a weird thing with me. I don't really like the vibes with Coca-Cola anyway, so these gummies, the Coca-Cola ones that are inside, I will probably give to my dad or someone else. There's like the gummy bears, there's the cherries, the Coca-Cola one, the rings, and the snakes. And I'm excited to try them, so I'll probably just be snacking on these throughout the days when I'm interning. Today was honestly a really tough day, so let's sit down on my chair right here because I've been just sitting on the ground and that's not really fun for me, so. As you guys know, it's St. Patty's Day. Haha. <laughs> I'm actually wearing green. It's my sports bra, so. Sorry if you guys were not expecting that. But in other news, I'm not sure if you guys have been keeping up with the news, but eight people have died in Atlanta and they look like me and they look like my family members. And it's it was really hard to kind of just have all the media be consuming my mind as I'm trying to work throughout the day. It was really tough. And I was talking to my sisters too, how we were all just, just feeling down, not really knowing how to process it. <sighs> So yeah, I just wanted to share that. It's scary to know that I could be at risk when I go outside, but even thinking about like my parents or my sisters going outside, it's just a lot to process. And it's really scary to know that it's not too far from home to be in these instances, to potentially be in these instances based on the locations of where people have been getting harassed. I just think at the end of the day, everyone just needs to love one another and support as much as we can. Yeah, and just be there. Even if you're not a person of color, or even if you identify as another color in the POC, I just think we all need to love each other and just like fuck the colors. Like, we just need to love each other. It breaks my heart to know that there was, you know, not too far ago last year. This is so heavy to talk about. I, I, can't, I don't even know like how to express, but just like last year, the black community was targeted so heavily and the BLM movement was so empowering. Black lives still go through violence and fear every single day. And now also flash forward to now, a year later, the Asian American community is also facing historical, terrifying time. This year was really hard for everybody and it just feels like things are getting harder. So I urge you and I urge us to just really be there for each other as much as possible and tell someone that you love them. Tell your close loved ones and, and anyone around you that you love them. Live so gratefully. Just being so thankful for your own life and also being able to be an impact in someone else's life and having them in your life. I had a call with my grandma today. She lives in Korea and it was really nice to be able to hear her voice and you know health wise as she's getting older it's getting tougher but like I in my head just felt like, wow, I'm really glad that she's living in Korea right now because if she was living here, I would be so, so fearful. Wow, I did not expect this to end in this note, but I did want to just speak up and say something about it because I've been kind of chasing my thoughts and trying to process it throughout the day. So I think I'm just going to journal a bit now and shower. I should probably shower first. So I think I'm just gonna um, probably not talk, but I'll just like film what I'm up to and just close out the vlog. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. I love you. I hope you know that. And I hope you can also tell someone else that you love them today. I'm gonna go shower now, so see ya.